Hi guys, it's V, and today I'm coming back to you with another video. I don't even know where this video is going. I just decided to make a video. Okay, so yeah, I don't have any makeup, oh, just good. my eyebrows because I naturally don't have, barely have any eyebrows. So if I didn't do them, y'all wouldn't even see nothing up there. And then I did my lipstick, and my hair is just a mess right now. So. I don't care. Then I just have on like a little sweater and some shorts. I'm glad y'all can't see the bottoms because I only got dressed up on the top. Okay, so I guess this video is going to be about me failing the tease test. I don't know. Should that be what the video be about? Okay, so yeah, um, I'm going back track. So two years ago, I was supposed to start nursing school. Took the T's test, passed with flying colors, right? But then I saw the price of the nursing school. So I chickened out like 19 days before the school started. I was like, I can't do oh, this. Oh, come on. Okay? And then, so recently I decided to go back to school um, because I'm about to be 20. I'm about to get it out of the way. I decided to go back to school. So I, I applied for a nursing school. And now I have to take my T's test, right? So. I took the first practice test. I got a low score, but then I studied, studied, studied. I took the second practice test. I got higher than the score I needed, so I thought I was good. So let me tell y'all, I stopped studying for like three days. Three days before my test, I did not study. And then last night, right before my test, right, the night before my test, I studied for about 20 minutes, and then I was like, I got this. I don't need to study, right? So, I went in there, I took the test. First off, red flag number one. In my mouth section, right? You, you know how there's like graphs and bar graphs and just pictures and stuff? The Adobe Reader, I guess it was, was not working. So some of the graphs would not pop up, right? And they couldn't figure out why. Oops. They couldn't figure out. Let go of my hair. Let go of my hair. Baby. Okay, now like I was saying, they could not figure out why my graphs wasn't popping up. So, you know what I did? I just opted for guessing on the ones that weren't popping up, right? And that was that was a few questions, right? And then the graphs started slowly coming in on certain pages, right? So, yeah. Red flag number two. I got done with that test entirely too quick. Like I should have went back and try to reevaluate everything. But the test is, they give you four hours for the test. They usually say you use up about three. Guess how many hours I used up? One. <laughs> One hour and like 10 minutes. So I kinda knew that something was up. So yeah, I went to go see my results after I took the test and you know, I didn't get a high enough score. You know, at first I was kind of sad and I like wanted to cry and whatnot. Because I paid $100 for that test. But then, you know, I was talking to my boyfriend and he was just like, don't stress it. Don't stress it. Cut your losses. You know, just try again. So, yeah, trying again now. The first time, um, well, this time that's a tease. Right before, before I, I took it. I use the T's practice exam, and I'm going to show y'all that. Give me one second. All right, y'all, I'm back. So, first, um, for this test, I use this, the ATI practice test, right? I meant the ATI test book. And this is the one you get from ATI, their website, the people who make the T's test, right? So, yeah, I, I thought because I was using their official booklet that I was going to get a high score. But I guess not. I was so confident going to that test, too. The first time back in 2014 when I took the T's test, excuse me, I didn't have no test book. I just used the internet, and I took a whole bunch of practice tests, which I guess I should have did again. But, you know, I thought because that book is from ATI, and they made the T's test, that I would be good. Obviously not, but I was just studying the science section, so that could be it, too. I don't know. 
But oh. now, before I take the T's test again, which should be in like a I week or two. No joke. I, yeah, I am a boyfriend. Well, it should be like in a week or two. Then I'm, I'm going to do the practice test online. And I'm going to use the book because yeah. that's what a smart person would do. Um, I would go to tutoring, but I got a baby. And I don't like being away from my baby for too long if I don't need to be. So I know I can get the score for the test because I got the score on the practice test, right? And it took me longer to take the practice test than it took me to take the actual test. So next time I know that I need to slow my roll because I was, I was trying to hurry up and get back home to the baby, to be honest. Um, and it was hot. It was hot in the test room. It was a lot of people in there. So I was like, I just want to take this test and go. So next time, I'm actually going to take my time. I'm actually going to study this time. So y'all, pray for me that I pass this test. Pray for me. Don't wish me good luck. Pray for me that I pass this test. Um, pray for me that I get inside of the nursing school that I need to get, well, that I want to get into. And some information about the nurse school that I want to get into is an accelerated program. It's 17 months, and it is an ADN program. So, yeah, y'all. I just wanted to let y'all know, because I know I mentioned in some of my previous videos that I was taking, I was studying to take the T's test. So, yeah, it's embarrassing for me to tell y'all that I failed, but I didn't get a high enough score that I needed to. But, I'm going to be the better man and let y'all know. And I only missed the score I needed by .3, not 3, .3. So if I would actually took my time or on some of them, um, some of the ones that was missing a graph that I guessed on, then I know I could have got that .3 and passed. But I don't know. I was, I, I don't know. I didn't really get a lot of sleep last night. Welcome so yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know, but I'm going to go, if this is your first time coming to my channel, hey y'all, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and um, I have a vlog channel, and it is going to be in the description bar below, if you want to see me do daily vlogs with my family, or if you want to see me study for the teas, or if you just want to be nice, go subscribe to my channel, go check it out y'all.